Although cannibalism disappeared with the spread of Christianity, another unusual ritual practice survives in Fiji today. Vila Vila Irevo literally means jumping into the oven. This practice of firewalking is performed almost exclusively by members of the Sawa'u tribe from the island of Benga off the coast of Viti Levu. The mythic explanations for this rite are contained in the oral tradition of the tribe. Many years ago on the island of Benga, a tribe called Sawau lived in a mountain village called Novakaisese. In this village, there lived a famous storyteller known as Nrenre, who regularly entertained the members of the tribe with his stories. It was customary for the people of the village to bring gifts to Nrenre in appreciation of his entertainment. On one occasion, when asked what gifts he would like, he requested each person of the audience to bring him the first things they found while hunting the next day. One of the warriors of Mbenga, called Tuina Ivingalita, went fishing for eels in a mountain stream. The first thing he caught felt like an eel when he pulled it out of the mud, but it assumed the shape of a spirit god. Tui was extremely pleased and set off to present his catch to Nrenre, the storyteller. The spirit god, however, pleaded for his life and offered all manner of gifts in exchange. These, Tui refused until finally the spirit god offered to give him power over fire and this offer aroused his curiosity. To prove his gift, a pit was dug and lined with stones and a great fire was lit on the stones. When the stones were white with heat, the spirit god leaped down onto the stones and called Tui to jump in with him. Finally, he plucked up enough courage and was surprised that he did not feel any effect from the heat. To this day, members of the Sawau tribes are able to walk on white hot stones and direct descendants of Twina Ivingalita still act as Mbete, or high priest of the firewalkers of Fiji. Another fascinating aspect of Fijian culture is the storytelling dance, or meke. In a culture with an oral tradition, storytelling becomes extremely important as a way of recalling a people's history and myth.